In this video, we're going to take a look at creating links in PDFs with Adobe Acrobat. So what is a PDF link? A PDF link can take you to other locations in the same document or to other electronic documents, including attachments, websites, playing media files, or even executing a menu item. Clicking on a link in a PDF is similar to clicking on a link on a web page. So let's take a quick look at creating links in PDFs. Begin by opening a PDF document. Click File, then Open. Select the document of choice, then click Open. Adjust the page view as desired. Click View, Tools, Edit PDF, then Open. Click Link, then Add Edit Web or Document Link to create one. Choose some text that you want to add a link to. In this example, we'll select this table. Click Link, then Add Edit Web or Document Link to create it. The pointer now becomes a crosshair. Drag a rectangle where you want to create the link. In the Create Link dialog box, choose the options for the link's appearance. At this point, you need to select one of the following link actions. These options are go to a page view where you can set the page number and view magnification that you want in the currently open or different document, open a file where you can select the destination file and specify how the document should open, open a web page where you provide the URL of a destination web page to be opened, or custom link where you can set any action that you want to be associated with the link. Let's run through putting these options into practice, beginning with go to a page view. Click next to set the page number and view magnification in the current or another document. Once you're happy with the way that the page view will be opened, click set link. To test the link, select the selection tool from the taskbar. The created link will be shown according to its properties. Click it to open the preset link. Now let's look at the next option, to open a file. Let's create another link. Click Link, then Add Edit Web or Document Link to create a link. The pointer becomes a crosshair. Drag a rectangle for where you want to create a link. In the Create Link dialog box, choose the options for the link's appearance. Select Open a file from the list of options, then click Next. Select a file and then click Open. To test the link, select the selection tool. The created link will be shown according to its properties. Click it to open the preset link. Click Open in the dialog box. The specified file will be opened. Now let's look at opening a web page. Let's create another link. Click Link, then Add Edit Web or Document Link to create one. The pointer becomes a crosshair. Drag a rectangle where you want to create the link. In the Create Link dialog box, choose the options for the link's appearance. Select Open a web page, then click Next. In the box that opens, enter the URL of the destination web page. Now click OK. To test the link, select the selection tool. The created link will be shown according to its properties. Click it to open the preset link. The web page will then be opened. Now let's look at custom link. Let's create another link. Click link, then add edit web or document link to create one. The pointer will again become a crosshair. Drag a rectangle where you want to create the link. In the create link dialog box, Choose the options for the link's appearance. Then select Custom Link and click Next. In this box, select the link's appearance, then click the Actions tab. Select an action from the drop down list. In this example, we'll select Execute a menu item. Then click Add. From this list, select any menu item and click OK. Then OK again. To test the link, 
Select the selection tool. Check the link by clicking on it. The link will execute the menu item that was previously selected. Drag the Add or Edit Link icon to the Quick Tools menu to fix it there. The Add or Edit Link icon is now pinned to the toolbar. Another option to open Edit PDF is to click Tools. Click Edit PDF to open the toolbar. Now let's take a look at how to edit the visual appearance of links in PDFs. Create a link using the Add or Edit Links icon. Or click View, Tools, Edit PDF, then Open. Click Link, then Add Edit Web or Document Link to create one. Drag a rectangle where you want to create the link. The Create Link dialog box then opens. Here, choose the options for the link's appearance. Select the link type between Visible or Invisible Rectangle. Select Invisible Rectangle if there's no need to see the link. This is particularly useful if the link is over an image. To test the link, select the selection tool. Right click on the link to edit or delete it. Visible link allows you to select the line style between solid, dashed, or underlined. Here are some visual examples of all three options. Line color and thickness can also be changed in this window. Observe here how playing with these settings changes the outcome. You also have the option to select a highlight style. This modifies the way that the link highlights itself to the user when the selection tool moves over it. Invert changes the link's color to its complete opposite. Outline reverses the color of the link's outline. Inset creates the appearance of an embossed rectangle. Now we'll look at further options for the editing of links in PDFs. Click Link, then Add Edit Web or Document Link. Right click on a link to open the pop up menu. To move a link rectangle, click and drag it. To resize a link rectangle, drag any corner point. Right click on a link to open the pop up menu. Click Cut, then the Ctrl and V keys to paste the link. Right click on the link to open the pop up menu. Now click Copy, then Ctrl and V to duplicate the link. Cut, copy, paste or delete a link using this pop up menu. Click Select All in the pop up menu. Align the selected links as desired using the left, right, top, bottom, vertically, and horizontally options. You can also use the pop-up menu to change the size of the links. To test the link, click the selection tool. Then check a link by clicking on it. To move a link rectangle, click link, then drag it. Drag and move links at any time. Click Use Current Appearance as New Default to set the current appearance as the default. Click Properties to change a link's appearance and action. Learn more and download the Auto Bookmark plugin for Adobe Acrobat at evermap.com.